What's going on, man? It's your boy OG Odell, man. Out here with Go Live. Introduce yourself to the world, man. Man, first and foremost, I'm uh, Ted Young Prophet, man. Uh, you know, I've been doing my thing in the cater for a couple of years. You know, I'm out here grinding, man. Still trying to get that hit, man. And, uh, you know, working and networking at the same time. And, you know, enjoying the atmosphere, man. And the solid, man. You know, kicking it with people who like to kick it with me. And, um, now you go to much. But, uh, check this out, man. I see really you brought your own media push, man. You ain't like a lot of other rappers I've seen. Really, just to try to depend on somebody else to hope that they, you know, what I'm saying, recognize the talent. I see you put your grind in your own hands. What made motivated you to do that? Well, uh, what motivated me to do that, man, is you know what I'm saying, just the grind itself. You know what I'm saying, and the hustle within me. I know it takes, I know it takes, uh, you know, certain, certain ambition to get what you need to get. You know what I'm saying, especially with these guys. You know what I'm saying, we playing with really yeah. them. So, you know what I'm saying? So it's a dog eat dog world. And uh, you know what I'm saying? If you don't do it yourself, ain't nobody gonna do it. So that's pretty much where I'm at with it, man. And you know what I'm saying? You representing that east side decade. How long you been doing your thing? Man, uh since probably about 12, 12, 13 years, man, I've been doing me, man. You know what I'm saying? With the struggle, the ins and outs, the ups and downs. Oh, the rap, man. You know, all that, man, anything that can come with it. Suffering. Well, there's some people out here who looking right now, man, and they, you know, they rappers, you know what I'm saying, they, but they don't really know what they're putting their head into, you know what I'm saying? Some people, they, they get into this thinking they want to do it, and they find out they really don't, you know what I'm saying? They really put a bad name on the game, because now when somebody say, I'm a rapper, most people are like, oh, you're just another bullshit motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? So, we're going to take a trip on the ups and the downs. Give me your one of your best moments in your rap career, something that you could be like, yo, this was like, that shit. One of my best moments, uh, a bad moment, man. Really, I can't say I had a best moment. I say any moment that I get a chance to really just come across the mic and, you know what I'm saying, deliver my style or, you know what I'm saying, give to the people and, and they accept me, how they accept me, you know what I'm saying, every moment, every moment for me. Yeah, true, true. But I'm talking about like balling though. I mean, like you ain't never just know what I'm saying went to the show, you know what I'm saying, 12 bitches followed you to you know what I'm saying, the hotel, you know what I'm saying, hey. all of them suck y'all, you know what I'm saying, you ain't, I mean, for real. Hey, you know what I'm saying, to, to be, to be perfectly honest, hey, man, you know what I'm saying, you, you get, you get what you get out of it, you know what I'm saying, you know, uh, it's yeah. more like, yeah, you got baby mamas out there. I can see how safe you're playing that shit. Hey, man, you got to be politically correct. Hey, no, no. hey, hey, I see, I see you. You're like, hey, look, boy, hey, you, should, you, you should be president. Yo. If Obama did that the first election, you'd have won that bitch. Hey, no, no, you can't get any more information where they can pull it out on you later on. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what they don't want to be. Well, let's flip it then. Let's flip it then. What's one of the lows of 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 your career? One of the one of the points you like, oh, man, this was a something bad, you know what I'm saying? Like, and, and what an artist can look to expect to have to endure if he really want to do this. You have to decide, this is the one of the moments where you had to decide if it's even worth it to continue. You know what I'm saying? Man, look up, look I, I up, think look up, look up. the losses itself, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, Is there any loss in particular? Yeah, like I lost a homeboy, man, uh, probably about four or five years ago. Uh, first first person to ever cut the mic on for me, you know what I'm saying? I was 12 years old when first ever cut the mic on. You know what I'm saying? To lose, to lose that, you know what I'm saying? That person, you can go in the studio and that, that person basically prepped you, you know what I'm saying, to get to where you at, cause he always with us giving you the pointers of how to do this and how to do that when you in there. Uh, and just being, having that system right there, man, and then opposed to losing that and then trying to find your way, you know what I'm saying, working with other people and just trying to maneuver without what you always had, you know what I'm saying? And after that, it just, just putting, working hard to get the money and the funds up and keeping the image up. And, you know what I'm saying? Every gain can turn into a loss. And every loss can turn into a gain. It's just having that, keeping your feet moving, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause it, it, it ain't never going to be to a point where you can just be comfortable. So, well, you most definitely, the grind can't stop. And the grind over matter. So, you know what I'm saying? That's what's really going to separate the great artist from just the nigga who had the song at one time. You know what I'm saying? Sure Good kicking it with you, man. Hey, Shout out to Twitter you, and, your, and your website and all that shit going on, man. Yeah, man. You can reach me at uh, on Twitter at One Young Profit. You know what I mean? Facebook, me Ted, Young Profit. Uh, HoldMyOwnEntertainment.com. You know what I'm saying? I got a new mixtape coming out, Appetizers. You know, I got a mixtape already out called The Menu. Appetizers be the follow-up for that. You can get that on that pill. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? Shit, man. I'm, I'm just out here, man. You know, I'm Why you picking the name Young Prophet? I just, I'm just gonna know. Oh, good question. Young Prophet, man, I feel like a prophet is a person that believes in God, you know what I'm saying? Walk and, you know what I'm saying? Deliver stuff before it happens. And I feel like with my music, I put it out there, walking earth day by day, taking, you know what I'm saying, life encounterments and turning it into a story and putting it in a form where this could happen to you or this could be your future or, you know, this could be my future, you know what I'm saying? Just putting it all on paper and putting it on record and watch it come to life, you know what I'm saying, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much just a believer in God, man. That's yeah, a lot of people ain't believing no more, you know what I'm saying? You hear it in the lyrics, you know what I'm saying? But one time for Young Prophet, man.